Yo, 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 welcome back to another video of Dope Fish Tank. Folks, today we're going to be labeling all of my tanks. Alright guys, everything is labeled. Let me go ahead and show you guys all the guppies that I have in my fish room. Got the Platinum Red Tails, Yellow King Cobra, the Tiger Guppies, one of my favorite, 24K, just a solid yellow guppy, Red Albino King Koi, alright, King Koi. The males have a hump on this head, kind of like flower horns. So these are special. I got two mil that uh, my friend and me managed to save. And uh, I got three regular albino koi. So I'm going to try my best to continue the king koi gene. Albino full red. Blue snake skin koi guppy. Very pregnant female that I'm waiting for it to drop. Red dragons. Gorgeous fish, one of my favorite also. Check it out. There go the female. And then in the 55 over here, we have the dark dragon, which are just pretty much if you use filter, these are just a contrast version of the red dragon. So got a show male guppy here. He got a ribbon tail, and uh these guys does not breed. Got a Gorgeous male down here, and then uh, a gorgeous male over here, along with the two female. One dropped, but I only saw one fry, and one fry is hard to save because it just take up a lot of space just for one fry. So I went ahead and pretty much said, "Survival of the fittest." I'm gonna let you survive and see how far you get. Hopefully, he survives. Over here, I got the. I, it's a very long name, but let me shorten it up. These are just snake skin blue tail. On the uh, paper, I got blue snake skin half blue, which don't really make sense when I typed it. But now I remember the name, and uh, it's just blue snake skin, snake skin blue tail. And then we got the blue dragon. And then I got the Santa Claus guppy, also right down here. Uh, I, I just got these, so they're chilling in this bin for a little bit. These are just going to be feeders, so, yep, feeder guppies up there. If you guys uh, look at all the breeders' rooms, there will be random guppies just inside of random containers. So, trust me guys, I'm not the only one. Going back over here though, quick story, I bought their mom for very expensive. And uh, I got lucky. She gave birth twice, and uh, I failed to pretty much maintain those two drops of fries. But I luckily I gave a couple to my friend, and he kept his alive, and uh, ended up getting a lot of males. So I went ahead and picked up two males, and they got three regular albino koi and uh one drop so that is just a regular albino koi but i hope these two do the job and uh get me some uh give me some koi guppies give me some babies so i'm gonna try to keep my try to keep these guys going and uh hopefully i don't have to import any because uh these are one of my favorite two albino king koi difference between a regular albino koi is the Ibano King Koi has a hump of on his head. If my S21 would just focus, 
you guys can kind of see bumps on his head and that is where the king koi comes in kind of like a foul horn so yeah guys labeling all my fish tank super simple but uh just make your fish tanks looks a lot more fish story if uh that makes sense that's like something you see at the fish store so all right guys weekly update i just showed you guys every strain of guppies that i have in my room till next time keep your sleeves wet i'm out so unnecessary